First is act on the important, don't react to the urgent. That's exactly right. So that's the foundational choice. That's where I have to be able to discern what are my real priorities. What's important versus what's not important. And, and you really do have to get that one right. If you don't, every other effort is a bit meaningless. So it's making the reason why sure it's you know number the one, priorities. Right? That's exactly right. That's right. They're yeah. not in random order. Great. Yeah, yeah. Number two, go for extraordinary, don't settle for ordinary. Okay, so in this choice, it's where we get clear on what does extraordinary look like to me. Because it's different to me than it is to you, right. just inherently. You're a different person, different role. So have I defined what it means to be extraordinary so that I've got this um, goal or this vision of what I'm working towards? And that you can align what's important to you so you can That's achieve right. extraordinary results. That's exactly right. Choice three, schedule the big rocks, don't sort gravel. Yes, so this is the metaphor. There are some things in your life that are worthy of your finest attention. Those are the priorities. So making sure that you prioritize your every week, right, to reflect what you've already decided is most important in alignment with your extraordinary vision. Versus gravel is the... It's all the minutia, right? Yeah. We all, it's the, it's the minutia right. that we live in day right. to day. Yeah. Okay, next is rule your technology, don't let it rule you. Yes, and this Too one's late. critical yeah. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> for many of us, right? Yeah. I mean, in today's world, technology can be the thing that either accelerates your productivity or it can absolutely be the thing that hinders you as well. Yeah. So in this choice, we talk about how do you make sure that you align technology to your priorities and create appropriate boundaries so it's not what's derailing you continuously. And not just derail, but it can consume you. That's right. right? I mean, truly yeah. consume you. Yeah. We'll yeah. talk about that. Yeah. Yeah. some today as well. And then lastly, feel your fire, don't burn out. Yes. So although this is the fifth choice, it's not a footnote and it's not because it's the least important. Mm -hmm. This is about how do you maintain a high enough level of physical and mental energy to carry through on all the other choices because you can make those choices maniacally, but if you are burning out, there is no way that you can execute on your top priorities or be productive in any real sense.